Here are a couple quick uh, pointers if you're having any difficulty with this uh, vector direction uh, concept builder. So I'm going to just start the counterclockwise from east. Uh, so before we start, I just want to mention that there is this help me over here. So if you click on the help me, it will give you some things to read about. Here it says the counterclockwise convention is an agreed upon method of expressing the direction of a vector. Um, I'm just going to go talk about it over here for a second. So the way you do counterclockwise from east is this part would be zero degrees and then this would be 90 degrees and this would be 180 degrees so we go this way. So we start here and so if I ended there perhaps that would be 45 degrees that's helpful. So if I go back to, let me see if I can find the right spot here. Okay, we'll try this first one again. So what I want to do is take this, it's, it's a protractor a little bit different than most because it's a full circle and I put the uh, spot right on that dot over there and now when I'm looking at it I've got to realize that each of those ticks goes by 15 degrees um, so, oh, I can't really, oh, I, I can pause that. That's kind of cool. So here would be zero degrees. That's 90 degrees. Here's 180 degrees. And then uh, this spot over here, I guess, would be, hmm, counting by, that's 30, 60. So it's 180 plus 60. I think that would be 240 degrees. So um, again, zero, 90, 180. This down here would be 270. And each one of these things is 15 degrees. So it's going to be some multiple of 15 degrees. Uh, so what did I say just now? 240? Let's see if I can put it in there. 240. And then I'm going to say check my answer. Oh, I feel so good. I got it right. Okay. So if you have any more problems, just give me an email or contact me. Thank you.